Okay, guys. Um, it's Shawnee. Just kind of want to make sure that y'all can see what I'm doing. Um, basically, this salad right here is really, really simple. Um, what I do is I go ahead and cut it into like little strips. Hold on. And um, I let it marinate for probably like 10 or 15 minutes. It's really not going to take that long um, to cook because if y'all have a George Foreman grill, then y'all know it really doesn't take that long to cook. But um, yeah, basically this is all that I do. I'm sorry, I never really just cooked on camera before, but um, let me show you the marinades right quick. Hold on, gotta wash my hand. Okay, so this is what I am going to be using for um, the chicken, and it's Green Valley. Um, ranch that it's not ranch it's just you know what um the name of the company is but if you can see not really but it says that it's um all natural gluten free and then sweetened with gyva i don't know what that is but i do use tablespoons and stuff so what I'm going to do for this um, real quick is this is 15, I don't know why it's so blurry, but it's 15 um, calories per teaspoon, per tablespoon, and um, I'm going to just measure out my tablespoon of this delicious Jamaican jerk marinade. See? One tablespoon. And then I am going to put it in the bag. And before I just add another tablespoon, well, you can just eyeball and see that, but it's not going to be enough for my chicken. So this right here is um, 30 calories going into the bag so it's about that much not not a whole lot you need and then you just um, throw it in the bag just throw it in the bag and you just basically um, smush it up in there you know to get all the Stuff in there. See? And then what I do, I always fold it. So this top is always up there, so I know that all of the air is gone. And so I just let that marinate. I let it sit out because it's been in the refrigerator, it's fine. But um, I let that sit out for about a couple of minutes, and then I'll probably put it back in the refrigerator. So let me just go over, um, you know, the different type of marinades. This is Jamaican jerk marinade. Um, that's good, like with chicken and stuff. This right here, I love it. It's smokehouse marinade. This goes good with like your steaks and um, your porks and stuff like that. I actually tried this on turkey cutlets and it's pretty good too. Um, I usually pair this up with, bam, uh, Adam's Reserve. Now this is all natural too. So um, one of the things that I'm trying to do is I'm trying to find like 
different things to cook with. So let me move that out the way. And then you can see that this one's almost gone. Um, if y'all are buying HEB, this week they're actually doing buy one, get one free. These are like about $8 a bottle. But um, me and my son, we love this sesame ginger dressing and marinade. Uh, we just eat it on salad. So that's basically what um, I'm doing. Now, other things that I'm using... Uh, let's see. This one's gluten free too. This Sanjay. Um, this is the Szechuan hot and spicy marinade and stir fry. Um, I use that, and then basically I would just eat this with um, like asparagus. Now. For y'all that don't know, asparagus is actually good. I just started to eat that, and um, you can make it as crunchy or as dense as you like it. Um, let's see. I think I went marinade crazy <sighs> this week. I know I got I got some another type of marinade. Um, I think it's like a here it is. Okay, so for those of y'all that barbecue and that knows good barbecue, stubs, bam, that's a good barbecue. And this one right here is a chicken uh, marinade, and uh, I haven't really tried that yet. And then this one is another Sanjian. Uh, my son, he really likes orange chicken, so um, I got that as well. So basically, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, six different types of marinades that um, I got. And basically, those marinades, they help me um, throughout the weeks that I'm working. And... Um, it gives me really good idea. This Stubbs barbecue, let me just, this Stubbs chicken marinade, it's only um, 10 calories per tablespoon. And then um, this San, San J orange chicken, it is 60 calories per two tablespoons. So that's 30 calories per one tablespoon. And this one right here, um, this Szechuan hot and spicy marinade, it is five calories per tablespoon. So, I mean, if y'all are trying to watch your calories and stuff like that, and um, you just really don't know what to do, I mean, I would highly suggest just trying marinades and you know, just putting different sides with it and stuff. So, yeah. Um, as I'm talking, this video is probably going to be a long video, y'all, just because I haven't learned how to edit a video yet. So, um, as I'm doing this, let me let me put this stuff up. Right quick. Never said it would be easy. Never said we wouldn't fall. Never said that everything would go the way we wanted to go. <sighs> Y'all. Oh, and then another tip that um, I want to give y'all right quick. <sighs> Let me see if I can adjust that. So, uh, video is already 11 minutes. I'm going to have to learn how to edit this stuff. But basically, I know it hasn't been that long, but I may hit it again with some marinades. Um, chicken strips isn't that long, so 
I usually put them to the side that way just because I like to see the um, the strips on the chicken strips. So, ooh. yeah. Um, I really hope that a lot of y'all join the challenge because, you know, I look back at old people, not literally old people, but like at old videos and I see so much success with them. And then, you know, I kind of want to have somebody else to look up to or something like that. Did that sound awful? But, yeah. So, I'm going to just let that hang out for a little bit. Let's see. Okay, well, in the meantime, while I'm doing that, I'm going to go ahead and get my salad ready. Basically, I use this bowl. It's like a dollar store bowl or whatnot. But, um... Okay, so as I'm getting my salad together, this is the HEB um, Baby Spring Mix. And, you know, as I'm getting the salad together, my chicken's cooking. So by the time that it's finished, my chicken should be done. I'm not sure if y'all saw how big that package was, but that was only like $5. So, um, I put about this much, and, okay, so, um, I'm done with my salad, put that up in there, and then getting out my sesame ginger salad. So this is one teaspoon. And then this is two teaspoons. I'm going to just go ahead and put three teaspoons in there. So that's 75 calories. But, okay, this is one thing that y'all got to keep in mind. Just because it says 75 calories per tablespoon doesn't necessarily mean that y'all are going to eat everything in that tablespoon. Okay, y'all aren't going to eat the whole tablespoon. Y'all are just going to eat, like, what's on your salad. There's still going to be, like, dressing left over. So keep that in mind. Okay. Basically, what I do is I take my tongs. And I just, you know, toss it around. So I'm done tossing that around. Let me check on my chicken. Yep, see? Chicken's already done. I'm just going to turn that right quick. Just so um, I can get the lining on, on both sides. But just got to find something to cut that with. And I am done. So, um, let's see. I'll use one of these plates, I guess. So, can y'all see it? So, I'll just spread that over like that. Okay. 
y'all see. And my son, he loves, 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 loves this. Chicken's done. One chicken. And of course, you know, I'm going to cut this as I'm eating it. So it doesn't have to be perfect. Two chicken, three chicken. Four chicken. And that's basically it. Um, what I used was a whole chicken breast. And I still got like a lot of pieces left. So I'm going to just save this for tomorrow. And that's basically it. So this is my salad that I'm going to eat tonight. I really hope that y'all consider like um, marinades and stuff like that. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I know it was hella long, but um, I'm going to try to edit it. Oh, well. All right, then. Bye, y'all.